Our land is always moving, but not that fast. My name is David Evans of the Royal Ontario Museum. Right now, we're at Research Casting International in Trenton, Ontario, where work is underway building dinosaur casts for our Ultimate Dinosaurs exhibition. The exhibit documents how continental drift promoted the evolution of dinosaurs, which is something we find our favorite animated friends in Ice Age continental drift getting caught up in as well. The ROM Ultimate Dinosaurs exhibition will have some of the strangest and largest dinosaurs ever to evolve on display. My job is to find out more about the history of life on Earth. I'm one of the lucky ones. I get to study dinosaurs for a living. Movies like Ice Age teach people that the Earth is always moving. It helps to explain things like earthquakes and volcanoes, but it also allows us to explain the distribution of plants and animals. Dinosaurs evolved about 250 million years ago when all the continents on the Earth were together into one supercontinent called Pangaea. The continents divided into the continents that we know today. Dinosaurs were passengers on those plates and it had a big effect on their evolution. The heat within the Earth's core causes movement within the rock of the Earth and moves the plates at the Earth's surface we're talking about one to two centimeters a year. That's the same rate at which your fingernail grows. It's very likely, at some point in the future, all the continents will drift back together and another Pangaea will form. There you have it. I hope you've learned something about our amazing planet. Enjoy your movie. <laughs>